Good morning all. Today we have a poem to learn. It's called Justice. So first, before we read our poem, let's learn a paragraph related to the poem. Let's read the paragraph. A child playing on the street was hit by a speeding vehicle. The child was lying in a pool of blood. It was shifted to a hospital. The doctors who examined the child told its parents that the child needed immediate blood transfusion and they must arrange for four bottles of blood immediately. The eager parents offered good money for buying blood. Many young men did give blood but none accepted the money offered. They bluntly told the parents that blood could not be bought with money and that it should be donated by one person to another. So, let's learn the meaning of the passage. Here, we see a child meeting with an accident and it was, uh, it was lying in a pool of blood. That means a lost, lot of blood was expelled from his body and it was in a uh, severe critical condition. It was shifted to a hospital. When the child was taken to a hospital, doctors examined the child and told <coughs> its parents that the child needed a lot of blood for the blood transfusion. That means the child should be given with some more blood supply from outside. And they were asked to arrange for the suitable blood for the child. Then the parents were so eager to see the child being healthy. So they offered good money for the buying of blood. That means they gave an advertisement saying that they want such kind of blood and they are ready to pay a lot of money for that. So many people came forward to donate the blood and they donate the blood in return. They did not accept the money given by the parents. Why they didn't accept? They said that money can't be bought with, sorry, blood can't be bought with money. Blood only to be donated from one person to another. Because money cannot create the blood. That means money is very, very meager in, if compared to the blood. So blood is so precious and it cannot be bought by the money. Saying that they went without accepting the money offered by the parents. So this is the story of the passage. Let's learn one more paragraph regarding the poem. Here we see <clears throat> introduction. Human life is based on certain values. Values still govern our lives. Justice is one such value that ensures an exploitation free life. But unfortunately, in the present day, justice has become a commodity of sale for some people. Though there are immoral attacks on justice, it has survived the test of time only because of its inherent strength. So here, there is a mention of a value called justice. Justice means being fair, being impartial to anyone. So human life is based on certain values. We are all humans, not animals. So we have adopted some values in our life like justice, truthfulness, kindness, forgiveness. Those are the values we adopted in our life. These values are very, very important in our life. They rule our life. Whenever we behave, whenever we act, we act according to the values. So, just is one of the best value among all these values, we can say. What happens when we adopt justice? It allows us to live a exploitation-free life. Exploitation means cheating on somebody or making use of somebody in very unfair way. That will be avoided when we adopt the value justice. But unfortunately, in the present day, justice has become a commodity of sale for some people. But these days, justice is a commodity, a thing which can be bought with the money also. And that's very sad. Justice should not be bought with the money. Justice should be given to the person who deserves it. But these days become a commodity to, commodity to be sold. Though there are immoral attacks on justice, it has survived the test of time only because of its inherent strength. 
since the people co- converted the justice the value into a commodity the value became very useless one now because even a person very uh, criminal one or injustice one still he is able to get the justice by paying the money maybe in the court or outside of the court anywhere if a person has a money he is considered as a very innocent one very fair one so that cannot be a justice and very sadly nowadays the people are taking the value as a commodity they are buying it for the money and that's a very sad thing but still there are beliefs there are events where truth is unrevealed and truth is hidden and finally they are revealed they are released from the darkness that is the strength of the real justice so somehow finally even after a long time some time even it is too late still justice is given that is the inner strength of the justice the value justice so here what we see from these two paragraphs we see that some values cannot be bought with the money some values are hidden some values are troubled so what are the things which makes them to be hidden be troubled let's learn with the help of this poem here so first let's read the poem justice it's written by the indian poet pravin kumar there's an introduction about the poet in the next page you can read them you can read, read it out later on let's read the paragraph justice begotten in exchange is no justice for exchange is trade a distressing gain through loss justice is inherent right though wrapped in black pack in dark hall of race for survival like gold strings bound in mud till exploited she is cool like ice and still like rock no easy road to charm her soul while hardship makes her no more justice why justice is shackled to greed and bribe why justice is fished out from popular mood last in thick jungle of lightless night like a rat caught in the sack of death like deer caught in the lion's lair she never reaches self by herself justice with no heart for truth justice with no dash for right cause is justice dead indeed so now let's learn the meaning of the each paragraph the first paragraph justice begotten in exchange is no justice for exchange is trade a distressing gain through loss justice is inherent right so what do you mean by justice justice is being impartial being very fair to someone but that justice cannot be so justice cannot be bought 